Thank you for choosing UK Weather Forecast Channel on YouTube. This is the headline. Freezing fog over parts of England Monday morning rush hour. Monday. Southern, eastern and central England cold with early freezing fog slow to clear from some spots and otherwise some sunshine. Cloudier and milder elsewhere in the UK. Outlook for Tuesday to Thursday. Patchy frost and fog across parts of southern England Tuesday. Elsewhere, cloudier with outbreaks of mainly light rain and drizzle, these spreading south Wednesday, brighter with showers to follow. Now, latest updates presented by BBC Weather's Darren Bett. Thanks for watching. Hello there. At the moment, the weather's not quite as you'd expect it to be. It's much milder across northwestern parts of the UK, much colder in southeastern areas. Not until we get to Thursday that things will even out. We're going to keep that block of colder air across southeastern areas until then, this milder Atlantic air struggling to break through that colder air that we continue to see in southern areas. We do see some sunshine, though, perhaps across more of England and Wales on Monday. Some mist and fog perhaps slow to lift and then replaced by cloud in East Anglia in the southeast. Further north and west, we're in that milder Atlantic air. That means a lot of cloud, maybe not quite as thick as it was on Sunday. Could be some sunshine around the Murray Firth, but generally 10 or 11 degrees in Scotland and Northern Ireland, perhaps struggling to three or four across some eastern parts of England at best. The milder Atlantic air coming in there around the top of that area of high pressure. It's underneath that area of high pressure that things are quite still and we've got the uh, colder conditions. And a real mixture really, I think, on Tuesday across southern parts of the UK. Some low cloud around, some mist and fog too, some sunshine beginning to break through perhaps. But as you head further north, we're still with the generally cloudy skies. Northern England, Western Scotland, Northern Ireland. Still a bit of dampness and drizzle coming from that cloud. Should be a bit brighter in eastern Scotland. Temperatures 11 degrees here, but only four or five degrees the Midlands towards southeastern parts of England. Now, as we head into Wednesday, so then we start to see the weather changing a little because we're going to find this weather front moving down from the north, pushing away some of that area of high pressure. So we've got a band of cloud and rain, not much rain. Most of it, I think, will be in the hills in western Scotland, followed by some sunshine and a few showers in Scotland. So quite a change in the weather here. Temperatures will be a little bit lower, perhaps. As you head down into England and Wales, ahead of that band of uh, rain, we've got a lot of cloud, misty weather and still quite cold, actually, in East Anglia and the southeast. That weather front moves through, it'll be followed by a northerly wind. Not particularly cold because the winds originate all the way from the middle part of the Atlantic around that area of high pressure. But we're going to find a bit more sunshine around, I think, on Thursday. Could be a chilly start. There is the risk of a touch of frost here and there. Maybe one or two showers during the day, but on the whole dry with some spells of sunshine. And temperatures by this stage are evening out, so typically eight or nine degrees. As we head towards the end of the week, we're still sort of dominated really by this area of high pressure from the Atlantic. Coming into it, though, we've got another weakening weather front moving down from the northwest. That will eventually bring some rain into northwest Scotland and some stronger winds. But with the area of high pressure calming things down once again for many areas, it's going to be variable cloud, a chilly start, some mist and fog patches, and then maybe a bit of sunshine coming through. And we end the week as we start the week with the highest temperatures in western Scotland and northern Ireland. As we head further on, this is the uh, jet stream pattern through Friday. It's not going to change too much into the outlook as well because we're going to keep this area of high pressure anchored to the southwest. Weather fronts and areas of low pressure will topple their way around the top of that area of high pressure. So occasionally we'll get a burst of rain followed by uh, some showers, mainly affecting Scotland, perhaps uh, Northern Ireland. For the most part, for the outlook, we've got a northwesterly wind. It's not a cold wind by any means, and those temperatures are pretty mild for the time of year, typically around 8 to 11 degrees. Don't expect, though, a great deal of sunshine in the outlook.